Hi there, welcome to IELTS Tutors. In this video, we're going to learn how to form and solve equations. Let's start from question number one. It says in the diagram, all measurements are in centimeters, ABC is an isosceles triangle, AB is 2X, AC is 2X, BC is 10 centimeters. Find an expression in terms of X. For the perimeter of the triangle, simplify your expression. Right, so to work out the perimeter, we need to add all of the sides of the shapes. So we, we will add 2x and the other 2x and 10 together. And to simplify this expression, we're going to get 4x plus 10. Moving to the next part of the question, it says the perimeter of the triangle is 34 centimeters. Find the value of x. So here we can solve, we can form an equation by using the perimeter of the triangle in which is given an algebraic expression and the fact that its perimeter is 34 centimeters. So we're gonna write the equation 4x plus 10 equals 34. And we can solve this equation by doing the inverse operation. We, as we know that 34 take with 10 will be 24. And inverse operation for multiplying by four would be dividing by four. So 24 divided by 4 will be 6. So the value of x is 6 centimeters. Right, let's move to this question here. It says in the diagram, all measurements are in centimeters. The lengths of the sides of the quadrilateral are 2r plus 5, 2r, 4r minus 3. And if I add all of these up, I will actually get 2R plus 2R plus 4R plus R will give me 9R. And 5 take away 3 will give me plus 2. 9R plus 2 is an expression for the perimeter, which I get by adding all of the four sides of the shape. And moving to second part of the question, it says the perimeter of the quadrilateral is 65 centimeters, work out the value of R. Again, we can use the fact that the perimeter in algebraic expression is 9R plus 2, and the actual perimeter is given as 65 centimeters. So we, we're going to so form the equation first by writing 9R plus 2 equals 65, and we can solve this equation between the inverse operation. Inverse of adding two will be taking away two, which will give me 63. And then opposite of multiplying by four will be dividing by, opposite of, please pardon me, of multiplying by nine would be dividing by nine. So I'm gonna get seven. So the value of R must be seven centimeters. Right, let's try our third question. And this time it's not about the perimeter. We can see that this time it's about angles. Let's read the question. The sizes of the angles in degrees of the triangle are 2x plus 7, 2x, and x plus 18. And we are required to use this information to write down an equation in terms of x. So if we find again the sum of all of these angles we're going to get 2x plus 2x plus x which will give me 5x and plus 5 and plus 18 will give me plus 25 and as we know that all the three angles in a, in a triangle add up to 180 so that's why we're going to write 5x plus 25 equals 180 degrees and moving to the second part of the question, it says, use your answer to part A to work out the value of x. Again, we can do the inverse operation to work out the value of x. And we know that opposite of adding 25 would be taking away 25. So 180 take away 25 will give me 155. And opposite of multiplying by five is dividing by five, which will give me 31 because 15 divided by 5 is 3 and 5 divided by 5 is 1. 
So my, uh, my answer is going to be x is equal to 31 degrees. I hope you liked my video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.